all right so i have decided to start doing a daily vlog which is a wanky thing to say i know but my thinking behind it is i've basically reached a point where i am plodding along fairly just sort of getting more and more miserable with about a million different things currently we're in lockdown uh, in the UK because of the coronavirus everyone's in the same boat everyone's getting miserable are they I don't know I am anyway I've sort of spiraled into this malaise really I have just thrown on weight hilariously thrown on weight gotten out of shape completely not that I was in any shape other than rotund um, I've, I've stopped exercising I've stopped doing anything I've stopped you know because we've had to stop playing football just sort of vegetated basically done nothing and it's getting to me now and you know I'm a stand-up comedian that has gone that is out the window for a year now it's not happened you know we're fast approaching a year since my last that's not true I did a couple of gigs during when the lockdown eased briefly but it you know outdoors did one in a comedy club with a massive restricted audience but whatever it's not there anymore um you know colleagues and friends and stuff have all gone and gone and got other jobs I don't know whether who's going to be going back who's going to be going back to comedy after all this I don't know some people will just decide it's not worth it and maybe will stay in their new day jobs I don't know but like Justin Panks the guy I do the podcast with brilliant comedian he's delivered for Amazon he's now roofing what's to say he ever goes back to it I saw today um a comedian who has done you know big big shows on american tv i saw him today in a delivery driver's van um you know no one is immune from it and i know that goes across all industries all areas everything i completely understand that but this vlog is about me really um and i'm doing it as a motivation for myself because I want to make some changes because I've become unhappy. I've been un unhappy myself, uh, with myself. Um, and this, you know, it, it goes across. I know everyone sort of feels the same, but this is for me, this is about me. So in terms of like weight loss, um, I'm now following a, a diet. I'm, on, I'm using an app called NutriCheck, where you put in everything that you eat. It gives you uh, sort of a calorific, amount that you can have per day and this might not work for everyone i completely understand people might go oh, don't use calorie counting diets but this is what i'm doing i don't know this is what i'm doing um and that's what's going to motivate me i think and again this isn't about anyone else this isn't about if you don't agree with dieting you don't agree with people talking about dieting that's absolutely up to you i can only talk for myself I had reached a point where I was unhappy with myself. You know, I've got a two-year-old daughter. It was restricting that. I'm feeling awful. I feel unfit. I feel like I can't do some of the things that I need to be able to do, take for granted. I hurt my back just before Christmas and it's taken a long time to recover and that certainly isn't helped by the fact I'm carrying a lot of weight, the heaviest I've ever been in my life. And I want to change. So regardless of your thoughts on it or how you feel, I'm not telling you what to do. I'm just saying how I feel. It's a very personal thing. In terms of that, you know, the mental aspect of it, the more unhappy you are with yourself, probably the worse you are to be around. I'm not sure. My partner hasn't sort of said that, but I can only imagine that's true. But everything, I just feel useless and pointless. And so I've set some goals. Um, I've started, and that was, that's what I want to do. I want to maintain a daily vlog on here where I will talk about if I found benefits, if I haven't found benefits. I've got no idea. 
but I know that the vlog will maybe help me maintain the things that I'm putting in place now. So I am going to set some targets for the week and then try and keep to them. And then if I do them, maybe I'll add to them. If things I don't like, I will alter it. It's gonna be fairly fluid, I think. But so first things first, I'm gonna meditate every single day. I have felt the benefits of it before when I've done it. I'm using the Headspace app, it's a guided meditation. Just gonna start right again with the basics. And um, you can kind of let your brain do some of the work. If you meditate and you relax and you follow it properly, you can let your brain do some of the work in the background. That's worked for me before and I think it will hopefully work for me again. Keep a note of everything I eat, stick to the diet. That is key for me. Knowing that I'm putting every item of food into the app, to me, makes a big difference. It stops me cheating on the diet and just thinking, fuck it, I'm gonna uh, eat what I like today. I'm really gonna try not to do that because I want to see a benefit of it. I mean, being, being big has been my norm for as long as I can remember. I remember being 15 stone about 12 years ago and thinking that was the norm. It wasn't the norm, that was a blip on an otherwise portly landscape, to be perfectly honest. So yeah, that's my goal. My goal is to meditate, to vlog every day, and to stick to the diet for this week. Properly stick to it, make a note of what I eat, keep it updated and uh, and then see you know I'm vegan I really thought I'd see the benefits of being a vegan three years ago but really I haven't because I've just probably put on three stone which is hard to do if you're vegan you have to really give me some credit for being able to gain colossal weight while being a vegan it isn't easy so I can take at least something from that that's it really. Uh, I'll keep you updated with what I'm doing, how I'm feeling. If I feel any benefits, I'm going to be absolutely honest. And uh, I'm going to vlog every day and put it up probably on a, either a Sunday or a Monday. I weighed myself today, uh, lost two pounds from last week. And let's just type and go for two pounds a week. We'll see what happens. I could do with a haircut as well. Look at this. It's a me just a mess. <laughs> just an absolute mess of a man. I've like aged about 10 years in lockdown as well. It's, it's awful. But, you know, we'll get this first bit done and then we'll talk about the creativity. That's what's going to be coming in the future weeks. Got a few little things I want to be creative. I've never really enjoyed long form comedy, but I think I might think about trying to put together some sort of show because that gets me active mentally in a comedic sense building a show is hard and difficult takes a lot of brain power takes a lot of time and it's important if you're a stand-up to be writing material and I'm just not haven't done for a long time but that's all to come this week is about meditating and about following the diet and keeping the vlog so Today, so far, I've done two of those things, and uh, hopefully, we'll keep the third as well. See ya, see you tomorrow.